Lenovo have just released a new BIOS and AMD graphics driver for the Legion Go under their new beta testing program on the Legion Gaming Community Forum. Both links to these posts can be found in the description. Starting with the AMD graphics driver, we can see that these are dated the 7th of November 2023 and Lenovo describes these as a step forward from the current official release of 11th of September, bringing notable enhancements. The upcoming version will be based on this 7th of November driver and will contain further enhancements for us all to enjoy. Installing this driver is quite simple as all we need to do is download the almost 900 megabyte zip file found on the community forum called AMD GFX and extract this. Once extracted, enter the folder called AMG GFX and we want to choose GFX install. Simply hold or right click and choose run as administrator. A command prompt will appear and we must wait for the processes to complete. Don't worry when the installation hangs on adding driver package as the driver install is still in process. After the driver install is completed, we can access control panel, view by small icons, device manager, and in here, choose display adapters and hold on AMD Radeon graphics. Choose properties, select the driver tab, and we can now see that the driver is 7th of November 2023. Alternatively, we can use AMD Adrenaline to check the driver date here. Finally, the new 28WW BIOS can be installed by downloading from the link found on the Legion Gaming Community Forum. This new BIOS, although not noted on the forum, I have observed some increases in performance and is fine and stable for us to use. In addition, we now have the ability to switch our memory speed between 6400 and 7500 mega transfers per second, alongside increasing our minimum allocation of VRAM to 6 gigabytes, as observed in the 25WW beta BIOS. To install the latest BIOS, make sure you have your charger plugged into the Legion Go and select the N3CN28WW file. Once loaded, we will be prompted as to whether we wish to proceed. Make sure you close any applications you have running, save your work if you have any, and press Next. Next, and then Next again. The BIOS upgrade will now commence, and after a moment, your device will restart, and you will be presented with a black screen with a progress bar. Do not turn off the Legion Go at all whilst this is completing. After a few minutes, the BIOS upgrade will finish and Windows will boot again and your Legion Go will now be upgraded to the latest 28WW version. Let's shut down our Legion Go and to access the BIOS, we need to hold the volume up button and press power once. Choose BIOS setup. More settings. Inside the BIOS menu, we can choose the configuration tab. And in here, we can now see that our minimum allocation of VRAM can be changed to six gigabytes. Scrolling down, we can also see that we can choose between 6400 and 7500 mega transfers per second for our memory speed. This is 7500 by default. Once you have familiarised yourself with the new BIOS, we can choose Exit and Exit Saving Changes. If you encounter any issues whilst using the new graphics driver or new BIOS, please post your feedback on the Legion Gaming Community Forum or drop a comment below so the team at Lenovo can incorporate your feedback for further improvements in the future. As always, I hope you enjoyed this video and please give me a like and subscribe to the channel 
as this tells me that you enjoy the content and motivates me to want to create more videos for you all. Until next time, have a wonderful day. Thanks for watching and I'll see you all later.